Let's make a floating object in Blender. Start by adding a plane, this will be our water surface. Go to the modifier panel and add the ocean modifier. Increase the resolution, size, and spatial size. Tweak settings like random seed, wave scale, reduce smallest wave, and add alignment to direct the wave flow. Now let's animate it. Go to the time value, press I to insert a keyframe at the beginning. Move to the end of the timeline, increase the time value, and insert another keyframe. Change the animation type to linear for a smooth loop. Next, add another plane, this one will control the float. Go to edit mode, subdivide, and increase the number of cuts for smooth deformation. Now add a shrink wrap modifier, and set the ocean as the target. Add the floating object, scale it to match the size of the control plane. Then select the object and add a copy location constraint. Before this works, we need a vertex group. Select the control plane, enter edit mode, select all vertices, go to data properties, create a new vertex group, and assign the vertices. Now, in the copy location constraint, set the target to the control plane and assign the vertex group. Do the same with the copy rotation constraint, target the plane and the same vertex group. And now, your object floats realistically over the animated ocean surface.